One of the hardest things to pull off in tourism is the marriage between responsible, sustainable tourism and high-end luxury. However, some people are proving that it can be done. I've come here to an eco-retreat in Western Australia to see how a different kind of luxury is being achieved. We'd like to prove to the world that we can offer and run a five-star luxury lodge style operation on a sustainable basis and without uh, without destroying the earth. Within the camp itself it's built on uh, poles that have been dug into the sand and platforms or decks. On that we constructed the tents, African style safari tent with a Sahara uh, shade cloth covering on it so everything blends into the dunes. As I said part of the theme we're trying to we are trying to show that we sort of um, can blend in with nature. The view from the luxury tents is of the breathtaking Indian Ocean and Mingaloo Reef and guests here get to make the most of it, taking trips out on kayaks or if they fancy heading a bit further out, there's a chance to see dolphins, whales or even swim with whale sharks. And there's more typical Australian wildlife behind the retreat at Cape Range National Park in the shape of rock wallabies. The number of these creatures have been drastically reduced since European colonisation, which makes these even more special. We've got the black-footed rock wallaby here, so um, they're a really lovely, cute little wallaby. Lovely long tail. The tail doesn't taper down on the end like a kangaroo or a euro. Um, it's really fat and brushy on the end, and that's so they can manoeuvre themselves around the rocks and, and get around really easily in their environment. Sal Salis is one of many sustainable and eco-friendly tourism destinations in all corners of Western Australia. These retreats are a great way to enjoy a piece of the 10,000 miles of pristine coastline, unique natural landscapes and ecosystems. The eco retreats like Sal Salis are going to become more popular uh, around the world because I guess trying to achieve exactly what we're trying to, to do as well, that holiday makers or people looking for destinations and special destinations uh, are, are really trying to support um, the planet, trying to support the environment and, and I, I believe that that's the, that's the reason why people are looking for the style of, of holiday. Eco-retreats offer gentle pleasures far from the stress of modern life. In fact, the only deadline you've got to adhere to are the sunset, the sunrise and the high and the low tide. You also get the satisfaction of knowing that your once-in-a-lifetime holiday won't affect the everyday lives of anyone or anything that lives here. In fact, the only footprint you'll leave is in the sand. <laughs>